What's good YouTube? It's your boy Tony D2 Wild checking in once again back at it like a crack addict today guys with another episode of God of Early Today with the upcoming Jordan 5 Concord <laughs> Let's talk about the fact that we got Bullet RC out of retirement. He dropped his first video in the past three months. And with that being said, I'm a man of my word. I'm going to be shipping off those Travis Scott's to him. White T shouted Monday on deck and uh, new sample shorts in full effect. No disrespect. These just dropped this past weekend and are available now over on sampleind.com. Go and check it out. Use the link down below in the description to go and get your pair of sample shorts right now but today guys we have the jordan 5 concord and these are set to release on august 6th which is this upcoming week so i'm a little bit behind you know it is it is what it is it's all good it's all gravy but we have them in full effect today to give you guys my initial thoughts and opinions and you guys can go and check out my secondary channel too wild for tv because i actually went to soul play and showed them uh up hand and personal as well and wow i'm seeing some weird stuff on this shoe automatic hold on I might have to let them know about this. We'll talk about this too, though, in the uh, actual in-depth review. There's some markings on here, some real bad markings. Bad quality control type of stuff. Bam! Jordan 5 Concord. Uh, real close to the uh, OG model of 2020. And pretty much the Jordan 5 Fire Red model that we got, but swapped out from the Fire Red with the purple hues of the Concord. And I'm not gonna lie, man, I like it a lot. As far as even quality goes, whoa, 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 don't mess up on me now. As far as quality goes on the leathers, they are similar in a way, similar, you know what I'm saying? I would say that the five here is more still, this fire red five is a little bit more plushy. And when I mean plushy, it's more soft. It's so soft that you see like the ankle pop. It doesn't pop out as much as those retro models that were releasing back in the early 2000s. But the leather is very super soft. Whereas with the Concord version, you can see this is more defined. You know, it's a little bit more defined. It's a little bit more tough. It's still got a good type of soft feeling, but it feels a little bit more stiff and a little bit more tough than that of the Fire Red. Both are coming from Soul Play, so don't think, you know, these are foo foo or anything. Nah, the same thing. And it has the Nike Air on the back, which the Jordan 5 Concord doesn't. So, something I wish they would have added to it but uh it is what it is back though check it out you have the concord jump man you also have that jump man on the sole with the icy blue you know what it do and also that concord on the tongue but also on the lace lock 3m featured on the tongue as well like i stated this is pretty much the fire red five but swapped out with the concord hues and for that reasoning i like this shoe a lot i love the fire red five so i love the fire red five but swapped out with the purple i love purple i love purples royalty type of color but specifically even that concord purple which is very similar to like a purplish blue in a way that's i mean i keep my room pretty much blued and purpled throughout every single video that i do you know because i just love that feeling that tone and the mood that it brings to the room so i like that i like it a lot but it features pretty much the same like i said dressed up fire red five now the issue i'm seeing at hand is check out right here you see that threading this is like glue but right here this threading as well as on this side it's like a yellow like almost like somebody pissed on them or something i don't know man just make sure you check your guys's pairs these are dead stock this is how they came i don't know if it was something inside the box or you know sometimes there's things that happen with the dyes and all that who knows but this is the box they come in jordan 5 box but it is concord out the box right there you typically you have it in red in, on the box it says white slash dark concord black jordan 5 retro size eight and a half and as far as how this release will be i'm not a hundred percent sure yet but knowing how soul play does their releases on certain things it might be an online raffle or it could be a first come first serve i don't i don't really think that this shoe itself is going to be crazy like i i, I that's what i at least you know at, at this at least thing i mean for me personally it's a pass for me it's a pass for me and not because there's anything wrong with it but because i'm just i got fire red fives i got purple shoes so it's not something that i really need on my radar right now there is another shoe dropping that's on my radar there's two shoes dropping this month that are on my radar and right now looking at them let me make sure i get my full-on data right now on stock x size eight and a half 
is being uh, resold. You can buy it now for $226. That is uh, the price point. You could sell it right now for 180 for pretty much retail. So 226 is what I'm seeing at the eight and a half price point, up to 208, 275 at 12 and a half, 260 at 13, and size 14. You're going up to to the 312s. 15 is a 495, but even the smaller sizes, the seven uh, seven and a half is going for like 282. U.S. Small is going for a 332. So, you know, they're going for a little bit around those crazy prices, but I think these prices will drop down as the actual shoe releases. I don't see this being a uh, super duper hyped up release. That's just my thoughts and opinions. But at the same time, once again, it doesn't take away from the fact that I think these are really clean. I like to add into these videos the resale price to give you guys a somewhat of a heads up of what you're facing. If these were going for $500 right now, I still probably would, I still wouldn't cop them. It wouldn't be a shoe I would go after, but it would let me know and let you guys know that the shoe is going to be a little bit harder to get if they're already going for that $500 price point. So keep that in mind moving forward as we dive in and talk more and more about resale prices on shoes so you guys can get an idea of the availability or how hard it might be to actually get it. But check them out. They also feature that same type of toe box as I stated before that was on Fire Red 5 from 2020, but I still like the more higher up toe boxes in my opinion, so teach its own. It does have that cardboard insert too, you know what I'm saying, on there just to protect, I guess, the lace lock or protect the 3M, 3M on the tongue, which is always a nice look at the end of the day. So, August 6th, dropping, retail price point, 190, Jordan 5 Concord. Let me know you guys' thoughts and opinions down below in the comment section. Is this a cop? Is it or not? I would love to hear you guys' thoughts and opinions down below. And uh, for me, it's a pass. But if you like it, I love it. It's a good looking shoe. So cop what you like, not what I like. I love y'all. I'm out. I got a lot of videos for y'all this week, so stay tuned. Let's get it. Peace. And then, of course, one of the shoes that's dropping this upcoming week is the Jordan 5 Concord. And these are nice, man. No okay. cap. Like the colorway is nice. Of course, I love that Concord type of look, the white, black, and that little purple, but you know, I already got fire reds and a couple others that kind of match it already, and this is definitely a pass for me, but it is a good looking shoe, and nice looking colorways, but I'd rather pull out the 11s if anything, I'm just gonna be 100, you feel me? But these are gonna be available up at Soul Play, you know, so yeah.